Hi, I'm Sarah Mitropoulosina, and this is a first look at Windows Phone version 8.1. Microsoft adds a whole slew of new features in this update, including live tile backgrounds, a whole new column of live tiles on the start screen, and of course, the star of the show, Cortana, a voice assistant to rival Siri and Google Now. Right off the bat, you see a difference on the start screen with 8.1. There's an extra column of live tiles, so you can fit more of them on the screen. You can have one wide tile and one large tile side by side, or six small tiles in one row. You can also set a wallpaper on your home screen, which will show up in the live tiles that use your phone's theme, such as your settings and the camera. The wallpaper scrolls as you swipe up and down on the start screen. Windows Phone finally gets a notification center in 8.1. It's called Action Center, and you swipe down from the top of the screen to reveal it. At the top, you can toggle on and off common settings, including Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and brightness, and you can even customize those options in the Settings menu. Below that, there's all of your notifications grouped by app. You can swipe away each app's notifications individually or clear all of them at once. The next star feature is gesture typing, where you can swipe your finger around on the keyboard to type. It's faster than pecking the keys and just about as accurate. Now for arguably the most interesting addition to 8.1, Cortana. Like Siri, Cortana is a female voice assistant who can help you search the web, set reminders, and directly call anyone with just a few commands. Call mom. Calling mom. You can enlist her help by tapping the search key on your phone, then either type in what you need or tap the microphone to speak it. You can talk back and forth with Cortana for more complex commands such as creating a new calendar event. She's a bit more witty than Siri and Google now and has a good dose of personality. What's the meaning of life? I've heard from a reliable source that the answer is 42, but still no word on what the question is. The operating system also adds a bunch of smaller features, including separate volume controls for ringer and notifications and media and apps. We get Internet Explorer 11 and Wi-Fi Sense, which automatically connects you to open public wireless networks. Microsoft's latest update to Windows Phone brings the mobile operating system closer to iOS or Android, but it still has a ways to go before it's going to lure customers away from either platform. For a full look at the new features, check out my review on CNET.com. I'm Sarah Mitroff, and this has been a first look at Windows Phone 8.1.